If you're looking for a home with a real opportunity, then I might have something for you in the village of Barraby. Number 20 Westry Corner, also known as Rocking Horse House, has been the long-term home of the current family and owners for around 40 plus years. The property itself was synonymous with the local area for producing handcrafted rocking horses. And from the front, there is a driveway. There's a door then that takes you into a generous porch, ideal for storing the coats and shoes, into the inner hallway where you'll find a cloakroom. And then further on from there, there is a downstairs room, which would be great as an office. And then there's a ground floor fourth bedroom or family room or playroom. And then returning back to the main unextended area of the house, you've then got the original lounge, dining room, and kitchen with a lobby on the side, which then takes you through to the utility space where the washing machine and boiler is located. Up on the first floor, we've got three bedrooms and the bathroom. The property itself is being sold with a chain. It's positioned on a plot which is lovely and directly in front of me right now, there is a detached workshop, which is where the rocking horses were created all those years. And that would be a great studio or work from home space or garden bar. It's got power, lighting and heating. There's another detached shed here also. And to my side, there is open countryside with a view in the distance of Harlexton Manor. Come with me and take a look. Welcome to the video tour of Rocking Horse House, 20 Westry Corner in Barraby, adjacent to a countryside view and also a long range view of Harlingston Manor. At the front of this driveway parking, the door takes you into the extended area of the entrance hall, then to the inner hallway and to the left where you've got the lounge. We've also got a cloakroom, uh, which is a great addition. And we've got this room, which I think would be a great office. And behind us is a family room or ground floor bedroom four. We've got the kitchen and there's a door out to the right that takes you into a lobby space which I'll show you shortly and then we've got the dining room with the patio doors out to the gardens. In the lobby you've got a door out to either side and then also this space here which has got the gasified central heating boiler and also somewhere to put your washing machine. Up on the first floor we've got three bedrooms, a view from the side here if you're looking to extend potentially subject to the planning permissions you could perhaps even use this as an access point and there's a view towards Harlingston Manor. We've got three bedrooms, bedroom one being at the front, range of built-in uh, wardrobes there, and also the airing cupboard. Bedroom two is a double to the rear, again enjoying a similar view out the back, over the gardens into the countryside. And bedroom three is a single bedroom to the front, with a bulkhead from the stairs rising beneath. Then we've got the family bathroom, three-piece suite in here. We're gonna head downstairs now, we've mentioned the driveway to the front. As we go to the rear, uh, it's good sized gardens, so I want a little bit doing to it to bring it up to a certain standard. But then at the bottom here, we've got all sorts of options and opportunities. The options and opportunities really revolve around the workshop, the shed, and everything else that's down here. The workshop itself is a lovely big space and would be a great work from home space, studio, creative space, or even a garden bar, or somewhere to operate a small business from. If you'd like some more information about this home that's being sold in no one would chain, then please do get in touch with the contact details that are on the screen. Thank you very much for watching. From here.